it's me it's winky welcome back to my channel yes i still do videos apparently um <laughs> anyway it's been a while since i last posted um, a lot has happened uh, but today we're going to be doing our May bullet journal theme, which is Star Wars themed, as you can tell from the title and the thumbnail probably. I chose to wear this sweater because I thought it had like a spacey kind of vibe with stars maybe. I'm not actually wearing sweaters anymore. It is getting a lot warmer here in Vancouver, um, just FYI. Um, but <laughs> without further ado, let's just jump right to the video. Hi, welcome back to another podcast. Okay, I know it's weird that I say hi in the intro and then I say hi again when I do this, but I record them separately, so don't come at me, okay? Um, welcome back. So I did a tracing of the logo uh, and then I just went over it and with a white pen and I'm using the Sakura Jelly Rolls here. Um, they come in a package of six with three different sizes, two of each. Clearly, we're doing a Star Wars theme, as I mentioned before, but more specifically, we're doing a Clone Wars theme. The reason for that is because every year, well, not, not, not every year, but since last year, I've always, I say I've done this for a long time, but this has only been happening for two years. Okay, so last year, I dedicated the month of May to Max because it was, it's his birthday month. Um, so last year, I did a muted colors theme because that was his birthday favorite palette I guess so I did that I'll try to insert it into the video here and then this year uh, he's been super into the Clone Wars and for those of you who don't know Clone Wars is uh, sort of like a prequel it's an animated series that happens in terms of the timeline between episode 2 and episode 3 of the Star Wars movies does that make sense I started I watched the prequel movies uh, recently for the first time and I actually got through it all uh, thankfully it was I, the first time I tried to watch it it was so boring and the CG was so bad for some reason watching it on Disney plus the quality was better so maybe it, it didn't look as shitty as it was the first time so it was bearable so I finished watching it I, I enjoyed it and now um because I'm an amazing girlfriend and I am interested in things that my boyfriend is interested in so Max got me into watching Clone Wars with him so that's what I have been doing lately um he's re-watching it all with me but we're watching it in a weird order apparently it's like it fits chronologically so on this side of the page I am doing a title page obviously with the most famous phrase of all probably may the force be with you Ta da there it is <laughs> I had to throw that in somewhere. I was thinking, should I do it on the May of May 4th? Because it's that Star Wars day. But then um, the whole month is Star Wars. So I was like, might as well just use a proper phrase. So I colored it in with black. And then I went over with uh, the jelly rolls again to create some stars for some galactic slash space kind of pattern going on. Also on this title page uh, are some lightsabers. And you can notice that I spent a lot of time drawing the handles uh, of the lightsabers. And that's because I tried to stay uh, authentic. So on the top, the handle belongs to Obi-Wan Kenobi, which is Max's favorite character. Um, I kind of messed up though because he doesn't actually have a green blade. He uses a blue blade, but I messed up. But green and blue are both for the good guy. So that, so there. Yeah, let's just ignore that. And at the bottom, there are two lightsabers. They don't actually belong to two different people. They actually belong to one person, and that is Ahsoka Tano. So she is also a huge character in the Clone Wars, and I think it's also Max's favorite or second favorite favorite character uh, but apparently she has a really good arc and character development and I'm looking forward to seeing that because I'm all about strong female leads okay power to the women um or females she's not a human I don't think actually I don't know okay anyway <laughs> she has she holds two lightsabers these two in particular are called Fulcrum and the Lost Grey, which I found on StarWars.com. Um, and so I drew them exactly. She as well does not use blue blades. She actually uses white blades, um, but there was no way I could have done that with white. So I just went with blue because blue is also for the good guys. So there you have it. For my next page, I did the calendar and there was some empty space, so I just I wanted to add some elements to it. And obviously, Obi Wan is Max's favorite character, as I mentioned before. So I decided to follow a tracing that I found of an animation 
drawing of him or a sketch of him um, I traced it and then I just drew the outline I didn't get into too many of the details I just did an outline of him um, because I cannot draw for to save my life so um, I just did an outline I colored his hair and his beard um, and his lightsaber uh, later on um, I think those are his I guess the beard and the hair is a huge feature of his, in my opinion. Um, so I decided to only color that to highlight that. And once you look at it, you you know for a fact that that's Obi Wan. Um, and here I didn't mess up. I actually gave him a blue blade instead of green blade. So I should also probably mention why I didn't do anything for April. Why I was so busy. Not that anybody of you asked because I only got like ten subscribers. Like nobody cares. But it's a podcast. I can talk about whatever I want, right? So last month actually march uh, end of march was super busy and super hectic because i got hired as an employed student nurse uh, at a unit that i was not exactly what exactly what i was hoping for and i got really sad about it because i didn't have any other options at that time so i was just really upset but at the same time very grateful that i get that opportunity because not everybody does but then as i was like finalizing my stuff and wanting about to start um I got hired at another unit, which I, which is exactly what I wanted to do, and I was like, fuck yeah, like, I'm so lucky not everybody gets this opportunity, and so I got hired right away, and then I had to say bye and thank you for the opportunity from the previous employer, and then I went to the new one, I had to do all the orientation that month, and then school was kind of ending and in the beginning of April, as well as my clinicals, so I had to wrap up everything there, finish up all my assignments there, so it was just a really busy time, and I did not have time to do my bullet journal, so what I did instead was I just did two pages of like an April dump where I had some pictures, and I did a little bit of journaling in there, so it's like I'm still keeping up, I'm not just completely erasing April out of my life <laughs> or out of my journal so I still added something there um, but now I finally have some time because I'm off in April and I get to do a whole theme a proper theme for May and as you can see I just did some doodles that also copied from the internet um, shout outs to people a bunch of people who just post a shitload of Star Wars doodles um, very helpful um, and on the left where Obi-Wan is I gave him a little quote of Max's favorite line and it's hello there if you watch the movies you'd understand um, the significance of that um, but yeah I just wrote that in there because it was Max's favorite and then moving on to the next page I did my habit tracker and also uh, the next four weeks upcoming in May uh, to help me plan. School doesn't start until halfway through May, so I didn't do a whole full page for two weeks. Um, I just did, I just combined them all. And also for the habit tracker, I did another lightsaber, and this one is purple. Um, for those of you who don't know, purple is, there's only one purple lightsaber. I think, I don't know if there's only one, but only one person who shows up in the movies is using a purple lightsaber, and that's Samuel L. Jackson's character, um, Master Windu. So, he was a good guy too, and I like Samuel L. Jackson, so threw that in there in a, just a different pop of color instead of just using blue and green the whole time. Um, and then I added some extra scrap uh, black pieces of paper, and I added that those white dots and stars again to kind of add to the space and galactic kind of pattern as well as kind of like an accent i wish i had washi tape that was like that but paper will do for now so i thought about putting a yellow lightsaber in there at some point which belongs to ray who is in the newest star wars trilogies after disney bought lucas films and correct me if i'm wrong but I think real Star Wars fans, not me, I'm not claiming to be one, um, but they generally generally don't like the new ones. Um, and I personally agree. I feel like it doesn't have the original Star Wars kind of feel to it. I feel like it was a little safe or it was too family friendly maybe. I don't know. It was very catered towards children, which I don't blame Disney, but it just, I just personally didn't like it. It was just not good. I don't like think the story was that amazing. You know, don't, please don't come for me. I don't cancel me. I only have 10 subscribers. I am barely a YouTuber. I don't even claim to be a YouTuber. Please don't cancel me. But um, that's just my personal opinion, you know, um, and therefore I do not acknowledge <laughs> the new trilogy. So I didn't put a yellow lightsaber in there. That's my reasoning.
And here is the final flip through. I hope you enjoyed that video. Specifically, I hope Max liked that video. Uh, you better be watching. Anyway, uh, <laughs> kidding. I'm not controlling at all. Okay, seriously, I'm kidding. I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm, it's fine. I know he doesn't watch my videos. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. My feelings don't get hurt. I'm chill. Anyway, I, I can't guarantee that I will be doing a June video. I hope so, because it's my birthday month, so. I usually am pretty excited about June. Um, until then, I don't know if I'll have more videos, but I don't know, stay tuned for a surprise, I guess. Who knows? With this channel, right? No expectations. Okay, bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching.